Nah, this looks okay, doesn't it? Lizards. Could be dodgy, could be okay. See what happens. Because I've only got one dodge, which is really what lizards struggle with. But then... And they might just cas everybody as well, mightn't they? So it could be, it could be close. People love to say that lizards have a bad matchup against elves, but it's not, it's not cut and dried. Oh, Shawnee 18 with a massive host. If you don't know who Shawnee 18 is, he's very much like Lupak. Amazing at Blood Bowl. Where are you in the Champions Ladder this season, uh, Shawnee? <laughs> Thank you very much for the host. <laughs> you can be my wingman anytime. Well, I have three and all ogres, so I'm also basically top. That's 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 amazing, isn't it? I'll probably ne that's probably my peak of blood bowl, three and all with ogres. Probably never get better than that. People want to wait a few weeks to get prizes, don't they? <laughs> they don't want to piss about without prizes. I want it in a few weeks with a prize pool. That's what I voted for. There's really no point in Champions Ladder without a prize pool. The 10 millionth touchdown scored in Blood Bowl 2. Really? Early October, yeah. One in nine. Coincidentally, also the eighth million touchdowns. God, my saviors are about all that, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good, BZL. It's pretty good. Lizards would be good for a team of legends, wouldn't they? With all six strength, six Saurus is, is a good basis of a team. And then you get one turning skinks as well. They're just better than gutter runners, really, aren't they? Movement 10, agility 4, sprint sure feet. That's only five skills, isn't it? It's amazing. It's 
String six blodge guards done for. And then plus whatever 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 mixed race team you were with. Maybe Ulf Werner some more string six. Or a claw claw pom from the uh, Yeti. String seven Yeti with claw pom. Pretty sure you can have Norse on the Lizard Man team. So that could be that could be a a good choice. I just like the chaos could have tentacles to shut down um shut down elf teams. Wouldn't really shut them down though, because all the elves would be strength five. <laughs> so it becomes not so good. Yeah, you could get a second Crocs, yeah. Imagine that. Punch him into next week. That's why you don't give away blocks, even with Ammon 9. Who dares, Rodney? Who dares? <laughs> I can't think of that as anything except um, that. He could go there and assist, but then there's a gaping hole in the middle, isn't there? Fuck it. Didn't need the third dice. Alright, made the three plus. And the other one. Glorious. Yeah, that's the thing though, like everything you've got to remember everybody's gonna be a legend in the on the other side as well, so that that makes it a bit interesting. We could have like a Clash of the Titans League where everybody has a team of 16 legends and see, see what happens. I think it's alright. I think it'll be a lot better when they fix the uh, res bug so we can actually have res. Um, until then, I, I don't know. I like, that, I like that you've got the custom teams and the, as I say, when res comes out. But custom teams and mixed teams and obviously... It's actually got all the proper teams now, nearly. Got a pretend team to take the place of Chaos Pact. Um, yeah, it's pretty good. Fix the touchdown fouls. Wow, run, run all down his guys just to push him that way. Seems a bit excessive. To be fair, Drew McIntyre can fuck off. <laughs> I'm just a Bobby Roode fan more than I'm a NXT fan. I do like NXT, but all about Bobby Roode and his music. Crazy that Nakamura would have had that. That would have been awful, wouldn't it? I wonder if they were going to give... Um... <laughs> I wonder if they would have given, like, Bobby Roode the, uh, the fucking, the violin instead. They seem to be totally clueless, don't they? The double-double E. He's got a good cage, though, going, hasn't he? He's moved forward. Uh, 
Right, I've actually got to stop them scoring a little bit, haven't I? Yeah, Bobby Roode with a violin. <laughs> it would be horrific, wouldn't it? <laughs> it would be absolutely horrific. Oh, I might as well revolt with four. Fucking bastard. Knew that would happen. Oh well, got a KO though. Got a couple of removals this match, randomly. Very good dice so far. But he might just score here, mightn't he? But then I guess I'll just beat him 2-1, so... It's alright. And these people in the uh, in Crendor's League love to make handoffs, I've noticed. That's one thing that I've noticed so far. They, they, they all really love their handoffs. Um, which, to be fair, probably not the best things to love. Handoffs. In Blood Bowl. Three plus two plus to get out of town. Probably want to stick the loner in as a bit of cover. And some kind of crazy cage. Ignoring threat. Cheers. Here we see the, the lesser spotted ball baser. <laughs> Not really lesser spotted. Not actually really lesser spotted. Got to base that ball. Yeah, frequently spotted. <laughs> it's the common ball baser, isn't it? Also, the, also the frequently spotted one dies pal. Into into cars. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs>
I like the <laughs> I like the punches that these bastards make. Fucked him. Minus AG. Yeah, the croc space is fair enough in it with a minus one. Um, or even just double double Saurus, so that I would have had to dodge. I mean, I could have blitzed him off, but I just thought I'd live dangerously. Go, give him the chance of his one in thirty six pain offering. It's funny that you should say ripping spaghetti because I was just eating spaghetti, which is why I was periodically muting myself. Um, but now the spaghetti is gone. Oops, slightly distracted there, but got there in the end with the correct, the correct uh, sidestep. Oh, and he actually, that's a good, that's a good, so this is a good ball base. There you go. Only when they blitz, um, mana raise, yeah, but it's pretty shit. That's a good ball base there, isn't it? With a, get, you know, I, I like going to the sideline with the blitzers because they've got sidestep, but that is a weakness, isn't it, when you get... Shepherded in there, so that was that's fair play to him with that ball base. Not all bases are created equally, and that is a that is a decent ball base. All right, now now it's terrible. Well, I'm not terrible, but uh, well, I don't know. I don't know. There's too many things to do now, isn't there? It's too hard. If I, I know, I'd surf him. I wouldn't change forward. But chaining him in here doesn't do a lot, does it? Because he's he's still based by uh, Crocs. I would like to uh, blitz the Crocs out. He could block him. He could block him. Then get two assists in here to block him. And then chain him. No, it doesn't work. I can't chain push him out. Well, or rather I can, but it's risky, I guess. How do I chain push him out? How do I chain push him out? I can't chain push him out. I can't chain push him out. It would surf him, yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, but I need to get the guys in here and I need to block this guy and it's not easy, is it? Got to roll dice. Only two minutes. And even then, if you... if you, you That doesn't work, because what, what, what do you push when you push the Thoras? There's no fucking chain on at all. I'm sorry, there just isn't. That doesn't that doesn't achieve anything though. So that so that the 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 so that it would be even more boxed in? Like, well, how does that help anything?
How would pushing the crocs to there help me? It just wouldn't. I don't know, I wouldn't mind looking at the, uh, I wouldn't mind looking at the replay and see what, you know, see what you're thinking about, but, um, but what would it achieve pushing the crocs in front of me? I'd still have a skink behind me. I should just blitz the skink out, shouldn't I? I should have, my ball carry should just blitz the skink and, or I should have just not dodged. <laughs> But they would have pushed the crocs to go to here. The the the. I I would have had to make another two plus dodge after using my reroll early in the turn. Fill in a place up here. Nah, it's too risky. There was wasn't enough players. No way could you have done that. No fucking way could you have moved all them players around. Nah, no way could you have moved all those guys around. I don't think so. Anyway. Oh, if you had, it would have been ridiculously risky. To get the assists in here, to get the chain, you'd have to get... You had to move this guy out of the way. But we'll, we'll go back. We'll go back and see... See how viable it was. But I'm pretty sure... Um, it was very, very unviable doing it that way. To be honest. Nah, I'm I'm pretty sure I didn't have the players, honestly. Yeah, but I don't want to feed. I don't want to feed Armor Seven people to them, do I? Like, yeah, you, you can stop the Crocs getting to your ball by just letting him eat your best player. But that's not really what you want to be doing in a game that you should be winning, is it? But anyway, we'll see. We'll see how viable it was. Bearing in mind, I've got two minutes to make my turn and I'm... Uh, and I'm streaming as well. But we'll see. We'll see how viable the chain was. But yeah, I shouldn't have gotten the sideline. <laughs> My mistake was going to the sideline when I didn't need to because I should have let, let myself the 3 plus dodge out. That was the mistake that I made, but I really don't think the... The chain I don't think was really possible. But the, the mistake was the mistake was not was going to the sideline just because I could. That was definitely That was definitely the mistake. Rather than an extravagant chain that might not have even achieved anything. And how do you get all the players to make it a two dice block? Like, where are you getting them from? They're making three plus dodges. I just don't, I just don't get how you do it. But um, yeah, we'll look after the game. Yeah, we'll look after the game. This catcher has to score. Don't have a block guy. Should have moved the ball first, maybe, eh? Hmm. Yeah, sidestep. I could have sidestep wrong. But I mean, the main thing was I shouldn't have gone on the sideline. 
I shouldn't have gone the sideline, that was the thing. Um, I'm pretty sure I sidestepped to the right square, but maybe I sidestepped the wrong square. That double score was shit, wasn't it? Now he's basing the ball again. Yeah, I should have moved the... Uh, should have moved the ball carrier first day eh, that turn. Should have done safe moves first, just gone near the near the end zone. But I was thinking of getting getting the ball to this guy, you know, so that's why I didn't move him. I was thinking of just get a push there, then move and hand off. But um Yeah, I'm not sure about the sidestep. I'm not going to defend everything I've done is definitely definitely correct, but I think um, I'm really not sure there was a chain there. I'm really not sure there was, and uh, I'm not sure the sidestep was correct. But the the important thing to know was that going the sideline was definitely 100% wrong. If I'd been stood here, I could have just three plus out, whatever had happened. So that's just a fact, isn't it? I don't think there's going to be anything better than him just dodging. I can't see, because he'd have to dodge out, which is a 1 in 6, to get the blitz, which wouldn't ser wouldn't chain him anyway, because it'd surf him. So I can just 1 in 9 it. There you go. Right, two men down. And he's four men down. Alright, so this should be an easy win anyway, shouldn't it? After all that. It's really tough though when I'm used to three minutes and you know, and then like doing the all the talking and shit makes it harder. And he wants to do a completion. And so does he, right. Two guys to do completions. Him to score, maybe. Oh, God, he's got everyone on the LOS. Can't even deal with them. Oh, I've just got to surf that guy, haven't I, actually? Think about doing the completions later. He pushes to there. Then he pushes to there, then somebody surfs. Champ ladder is three. Ooh. Then push him to there. Oh shit, I could have moved him to there. Oh, I guess it's not so bad. Then he pushes him to there, then he blitzes. Alright. Fuck. Fucking. Fucking right up right now. worked. Unbelievable, Jeff.
<laughs> Zero, <man. laughs> Probably. No, I haven't. Shoes move. I've been well. I don't know. It depends when you went to bed. Um, seven hours today. Um, which is all right. I th honestly, I think the. Uh, I think the. Um, the wild card is going to make Champs Ladder so much better. For me, anyway. Because I'm not going to feel like I have to win every game with whatever I'm using. Because I can finish second, it'll be alright. Well, top two. Top two, Ducky, not top eight. Top two. Top two of the top eight races. Hello, Scoots. Gotta surf this uh, this guy as well, just because I can. Yeah, what about Inarian? <laughs> <laughs> you knew Inarian was going uh, woodies, so it's all right, wasn't it? Can't reach, can he? No. No, oh, fuck, he'd get based by the crocs on the follow, wouldn't he? Oh, that's alright. So he's got a completion. He can get a completion. And then he can get two completions and a touchdown. <laughs> Yeah, Undead are very solid out of the box. Ha <laughs> got him. Bang down. Right, so he could blitz him.
He can go there. He can go there. He can go there. He can go there. He can go here. And he can make his pass to that guy. Good lad. He can two dice this lad. Power. I think flesh golems are just shittier mummies, yeah. Or like, they're weird. They're just weird. Because they start off as like, expensive black orcs. And they end up as like, cheap black orcs. But... I don't know. Nah, probably not Sir Ironclad. Probably not. Hmm, and yes, it does look like surfing a Saurus is possible, doesn't it? Right, he has to... Oh, he's conceding. Wow, no skill-ups. Bastard. Yeah, I did the challenges, way tricks. Thor. Oh, that was a shame. That was a shame not getting not getting the skill them guys up, but never mind. Dodge for him. Mm. I think one block and one dodge is fine. Not really, I, I don't think so, I was, I was trying to not think when I did them. And, uh, with a bit of thought, they were pretty easy. But without thinking, they weren't that easy. <laughs> they weren't that easy without thinking, but if you think a bit, they're, they're pretty easy, I think. Maybe he's dodge on this one. I don't hate it. The thrower got killed. Yeah, dodge on one block on the other. That seems fine.
Right, there you go. Now now I can have the team without throwers now that I've got the third. Now that I've got the third catcher, I can forget the throw. Oh, shit, I just didn't name him. I for oh, I forgot there was actually a theme to this team. Oh, for fuck's sake. Fuck's sake. Um, anyway, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.